last Monday, the start of the week, and I started with a little quick cardio with my cycle. Usually do it for an hour. I had some breakfast, just some waffles, and sliced up with some bananas. Now it's time for lunch. I don't remember if it's dinner or lunch, but my mom and I was just trying to make some super healthy pasta. So here's just kind of the whole process. Obviously, you got to boil the pasta, drain the water. So here my mom is making her famous pasta sauce. She's putting some olive oil, don't know what that powder is, and some honey. And then she's mixing it all together. Now she's cutting up some vegetables like cucumbers, cherry tomatoes, and some bell peppers. Watching this is so satisfying. Now she's cutting up a block of cheddar cheese. Once again, it's so satisfying to watch this. And then she is getting a big bowl and she's putting in all the ingredients, pasta, some balsamic sauce, and she's mixing it all together. And then she's putting in all the cut up vegetables, mixing it all together. And there you go. This pasta, let me tell you, is just so amazing. It was so good. And the pasta was also um, made out of chickpeas, so obviously low carb. And it was literally just the bomb.com. It was so good. You guys definitely have to try it. So here for a little dessert, I'm just making matcha latte. You guys saw on my Instagram story, I, I've already made this before and it's literally so good. So here I'm making it again. But um, if you guys wanna go check it out, I'll leave it in the description box. You guys can also get a discount code as well. They're so healthy, but so good. Then we had some naked smoothies for a quick little breakfast. And then I had this choco pie, which is a Korean snack. And then if you microwave the choco pies, it's literally like one of those expensive cakes. It's so, so good. I had it with some fruits. Now it's time for lunch, I believe. Here are just all the ingredients. My mom is just putting in all the ingredients into a large pan. Then she put in some glass noodles and this whole meal is called tapte. So it's a bunch of healthy um, vegetables and like lots of spinach. And obviously these glass noodles are made out of um, potato starch, sweet potato starch. So it's like obviously super healthy as well. Here's a little mukbang of me eating the tapte. It was so, so good. Yay, it's hump day. Half the week is already gone by and I'm here just having some popcorners. These are from Costco and I'm just watching some Netflix while eating this. This is like a very well-deserved break. It was a nice break for sure. Now my mom is making these cauliflower lasagnas and these are so, so good. And then she's putting some mozzarella cheese on top of it. And here is the finished look. Ooh, that cheese pull, heaven on earth. And I usually don't like cheese, but this was so, so good. 
put in some sausages in there, some potatoes, a little bit of pasta. And here she is making dinner. Here she is grinding up some seeds. And then now she has some plain yogurt, no honey. And then she's bringing up those grinded up seeds with some lemon, lime juice, lemon juice, and then some garlic and some honey. And this is going to be your salad sauce. <laughs> They're so adorable, oh my God. Now she just has some sprouts salad. She's just placing it on the plate. And then we have some tofu, a great way of plant protein. And then she's putting up those sauce on top of the tofu. Here my sister is giving a little taste test and she said that it was super good. So you guys definitely have to try it. Oh my god, this is my favorite part. We're making matcha macarons and we are using the teamy matcha powders to get the matcha and then we're just following like a super basic macarons recipe. We were so shocked of how amazing these were because we made it at home and it's a matcha flavor which once again matcha everything is like amazing and we also made like our own cream with the teamy matcha powder and just some like buttercream and stuff like that and yeah here's just like the whole um process It looks tasty, but it was tastier in real life. Thursday, I started my morning with another hour cardio on my cycling machine. And here we are just going to make some more pasta. And this is made out of lentil. And it was super, obviously low carb, but very healthy. So here we are cutting up some cherry tomatoes. Um, and then my mom just has her special sauce in it and then she is putting some olive oil in the cherry tomatoes and some salt and pepper and she is also putting some basil in there too. Now we are going to just all place it on a plate. And then for the final touch, we've got a burrata. Then she's putting some salt and pepper on top of the cheese. And let me tell you, this is seriously so diet friendly. Oh, by the way, that's olive oil. Um, this is so diet friendly. If you guys are all about that low calorie, this meal is going to be your best friend. It's so good, but it's super low calorie and very healthy. Now I'm making a smoothie. We just put in some frozen berries, frozen strawberries, some leftover tofu, and then some honey, some plain yogurt, and also some almond milk. And then we're just blending it all together. And here is the final product. Cheers to you all. Yum. Try it. I was trying to force my cousin to eat this. <laughs> But like surprisingly, he said that it was super tasty, even though he hates anything that's healthy. Mm. 
Then my mom made bibimbap for dinner. It was really so good. This is just a bunch of healthy vegetables and some grinded pork with beef sauce. And then they always have the egg on top, which is seriously so, so good and super healthy. Here I am eating while watching a lecture. Yes, that is the life now. I don't think I've ever properly eaten a meal on the dinner table in ages. It's Friday, my favorite day of the week. So here my mom is making some souffle pancakes, the famous Japanese fluffy pancakes. We try to make them at home. Um, and here my mom is just trying to make like a, I guess like a healthier version with like less sugar and like more honey. Um, and honestly, it turned out pretty amazing. They're so fluffy and adorable. And it also tastes good. Then we are making some yogurt bowl, oh, the turtles again. Um, here we just have some plain yogurt and then my mom's actually just cutting up some strawberries. We've got strawberries, raspberries, and blueberries, my favorites. And then my mom is just putting some chia seeds and also some of these granola, which is from like a super healthy brand with like less sugar then we are just putting some of this like powder and also some honey and here is the final product obviously super healthy once again and very delicious oh my god it's such a good day for picnic right we have our good